a wire is held up by two poles that are the same height, creating an isosceles trapezoid. Now remember, an isosceles trapezoid means that the two legs of the trapezoid are congruent, meaning that that's five meters, this one is also five meters. It also says, assume that each pole is perpendicular to the ground, so I can put my right angles there, um, meaning that this quadrilateral here is going to be a parallelogram. So we've got, um, this is 10 meters, this piece here is also 10 meters, and since it's an isosceles trapezoid, well, that means that these pieces here must also be congruent. So the whole thing is 16. The middle section is 10, leaving 6 left over for the wings over here. And they're the same, so 6 divided by 2, each of these is 3. Now, I want to know the height of the pole. I'm going to make that the H here. And you know what? I'm not even going to do Pythagorean theorem on this one. This is a Pythagorean triple. We've got 3 as a leg, 5 as a hypotenuse. That is a 3, 4, 5 Pythagorean triple, 3, 4, 5 right triangle, meaning that my H here has to equal 4. I mean, if you really want to, you can do Pythagorean theorem on that. You're going to get 4 in the end.